Meanwhile, at the White House... And action. I know this is strictly a professional call, but I couldn't let you come all the way out here and offer no hospitality at all. Oh, thank you very much. Oh, wait, you're not I the pizza guy. I town pretty soon. Huh? Yeah, I understand that. Uh, Willie! Dr. Woodard is here. Willie! Move your ass! Ah, there you are. Put some pants uh, on. We shouldn't keep Dr. Woodard waiting. You know, he's a very busy man. Do I have to? <laughs> Now, Willie, look at it this way. Your soul is mine! In some remote fashion, help Miss Evans. And it may help you. You mean like phonics? Now, unknown to yourself, you may have some very tragic... Line? Malady. Now, the doctor only wants to help. But we'll put you down, just in case. (laughs) Sit down, Willie. He did not suck my blood. I'm sorry, what? Believe me, you're not going to miss the little drop of blood that I take from you. We don't really need to draw blood. It's just my way of punishing you. Give me a hand. All I need is the tip of your finger. Well, you won't even feel this. Just look the other way. Okay, if I scream like a three-year-old. Little prick of a pin. Come on, no, please. (sighs) It uh, may be some comfort to you to know that I'm wanted in five states for arson for giving away your blood. Now. In a way, isn't that understandable? After all, blood is the life force. (laughs) It reaches in to the deepest recesses of both the heart and the brain. Oh, yeah. It is the familiar of our complete being. To surrender... Oh, God, I'm turned on. Even one drop of it is to suggest a partial surrender of one's utmost self. Which I love, but... Ow! Son of a... I shouldn't let you do it. Come on, give me a hand now. Now... You had no choice. Come on. Thanks, Willie. Your blood now, sacrifice helps lizard. prevent a world without paper. Oh, really? No thanks. I have to be getting back. Oh, please. Just a little. Willie? Sit. Stay. <laughs> I'm uh, not what you'd call a great wine drinker, but I, uh, I must admit this is excellent. Thank you. Thank you, Willie. Now, what flavor that Tootsie Roll do you want, son? Now, the doctor and I are both very grateful for your cooperation. Yes, we are. And don't you be embarrassed now by being frightened. Uh, I understand. <coughs> Woman. <coughs> no, you don't understand. Willie, that will be all. Now, into the French maid outfit and tidy up the mess you've made. So, who do you like May in the game I never tonight? See the slide. Oh, yes, of course. There isn't much to see, unless it's under a microscope. Just hold it on the side. And try not to swallow it like those eight other times. Mm. It's like a delicate little flower Willie? painted on glass. Yes, even under the microscope it has a certain beauty. The intricate structure of the cells and great variety of color and shadings. Yes. They're the tastiest. I guess some of the most beautiful sights I've ever seen in my life have been uh, microscopic views of hideous malignancies. Well, I hope poor Willie doesn't provide you with such an experience. Who's going to clean up after me? Really, though it may be. And surprisingly erotic. And yet, to be honest... I blame Bigfoot. You would like to see on that slide a repetition of what you saw in Miss Evans' blood, wouldn't you? As much as I regret to say it, yes, I would. It's a terrible thing to say you hope somebody has an illness, but I can't help it. Suffering is fun. If this slide shows what I hope it does, it could, in its own way, lead us to Maggie. Oh? How? Well, if we can diagnose it accurately, if we can find out where and how Willie contracted the disease, if we could even prove some connection between Maggie Evans and Willie. But you don't really suspect that Willie's involved, do you? No. It's not a plan that we've thought through. If the blood sample showed some marked similarity, well, obviously we'd have to go on looking for other connections. We'd have to uh, look very carefully. By having our injured workers bleed into huge cauldrons. Well, I must say... I'm not evil. That, uh... I hope that Willie has nothing to do with what's happened to that young girl. 
I would find it extremely difficult to accept it, even in my imagination. Despite what the sex but, offender registry as says. You say, I hope that we may have some clue, even if it means that Willie has to provide it. Mr. Collins, I wonder if I could ask you to keep Willie around the house here until I've finished examining the blood. You'll want to put him in one of those cone cars for a few weeks. He won't leave the house until I hear from you one way or another. Thank you very much. And, oh, doctor. I mentioned I'm not evil, right? Please be careful. Well, what do you mean? Well, from what I've heard, a very dangerous man is interested in what you're trying to do. Or, you so know, if you wanted to die... I was told that the man who broke into your office is of tremendous strength. And devastatingly handsome. If man is the proper term one should use to describe him. Oh, and what term would you suggest? I think it was a bear because it sucked all the blood from his corpse, you know. Although a beast would never do the things that are being done. No, it's the peculiar magnificence of the human spirit. Whatever that means. required to provide the potential for such corruption. Yep, I'm pretty awesome. I know what you mean. Whoever he is, he must certainly be, at one and the same time, more than a man. And less than a man. You seem almost sorry for him. Sorry? No, I'm not sorry. I just don't care. The truth is... It's I fun being him. eternally damned. I loathe him very, very deeply. Felt bad for about five seconds. Do you have a job or anything? Dark Shadows is a Dan Curtis production. And that means what to me? 